Hello, my name is Maria Miller from MathMammoth.com and this is Matthew, my mascot and assistant. In this lesson we're going to study metric, mu metric units for measuring length. And I intend this lesson for about 4th grade, it could be used for 5th grade too. And I wrote a big table of all the metric units we're going to look at in this lesson. The basic unit being here, the meter. Okay? And students are probably very familiar by this point with centimeters and with millimeters, okay? But actually there's a unit in between here too. Between centimeter and meter, there's a decimeter, okay? And each time the conversion factor between two neighboring units is 10. I wrote it here. 10 millimeters makes one centimeter. 10 centimeters makes a decimeter. And then 10 decimeters makes one meter. Okay? It also follows that 10 centimeters making a decimeter and 10 decimeters making a meter, that 100 centimeters makes a meter. Okay, it's 10 times 10. If you jump two units, then the factor is 100. If you jump three units from millimeters to meters, there will be 1000 millimeters in a meter. And then going up, we'll also have meters. 10 meters makes a decameter. And then 10 decameters makes a hectometer. And then 10 hectometers makes a kilometer. But hectometer and decameter are rarely used, if ever. So there's no need to really remember them much, except you need to know that they are there. The metric units go systematically by tens here. Okay? And here's my ruler that has centimeters on this side. It goes up to 60 centimeters, okay? So if I took 40 more, this much more, then I would have a meter. 100 centimeters makes a meter, okay? And if you have your school ruler, it has centimeters and millimeters, so you should be familiar with those already. Decimeter is this much, 10 centimeters. Here's a decimeter, 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 etc. Now let's look at some conversions between units. I wrote here the three things you mostly need to remember. One kilometer, thousand meters. One meter, hundred centimeters, and then one centimeter being ten millimeters. Three meters, therefore, how many centimeters would it be? One meter is hundred, so three meters is three hundred, simply. And seven meters, twenty-one centimeters. 7 meters is 700 centimeters, and then 21 more. So 721 centimeters. Or the other way, 800 centimeters obviously is going to be 8 meters. And then here, 495 centimeters. 400 centimeters is exactly 4 meters. And then we have the 95 here, left over, so to speak. These conversions are really easy because you are using 10, 100, 1000. Just have to remember the conversion factors. 52 millimeters, how many centimeters is it in millimeters? Okay, 10 millimeters makes one centimeter. So 50 millimeters makes five centimeters and then two millimeters left over. 18 centimeters, two millimeters. Okay, one centimeter is 10 millimeters. So 18 times 10 is 180 plus two. 182 millimeters. And a little more. 5 kilometers, 200 meters. Now we remember the kilo, meaning 1,000. 5 kilometers will be 5,000 meters, plus 200 meters, 5,200. And 8,470 meters. Okay, 8,000 of those will make 8 kilometers. And the rest is left here. Now let's go on to some applications here. First of all, addition. If I have 4 kilometers, 800 meters, and then some other distance, 7 kilometers, 300 meters, how long a distance is it together? I can add 4 and 7, 11 kilom kilometers, and then 800 and 300 meters, 1,100 meters. But that is more than 1 kilometer, you have to know this. 1,100 meters will make 1 kilometer, and then 100 meters. So in total, we have the 11 kilometers and then we got one more kilometer from there, 12 kilometers and 100 meters. Here, centimeters, meters, centimeters. Okay, 
Maybe you want to change this to meters and centimeters. That's two meters here, right? 200 centimeters makes two meters. So here's two meters and 50 centimeters. Two meters and four meters. Six meters. And then the 50 and 40 centimeters is 90 centimeters. It's not very difficult. Joe is one and a half meters tall. Andy is, maybe his little brother, 117 centimeters tall. Andy wants to be taller than Joe, so he stands on a chair that is 45 centimeters tall. Have you ever done that? Standing on a chair to make yourself taller? How much taller is Andy now than Joe? The main difficulty here is that something is here, here, this is in meters, this is in centimeters. And in order to add and subtract these things and work with these numbers, we need to have everything in the same kind of unit. Either everything in meters or everything in centimeters. And this time, obviously, it's easier to work in centimeters, so let's change this to centimeters. One and a half meters. Okay, one meter being 100 centimeters, so then half a meter, 50 centimeters, and in total 150, right? I'll put it here. Joe is 150 centimeters tall. When Andy stands on this chair, Andy will be how tall? We add these. Okay. This would be, if this was 120 plus 45, we would get 165. And it is 3 centimeters short of that, 162 centimeters. And Joe being 150 centimeters, we look at the difference, it's 12 centimeters difference. So that's how much taller he is than Joe. Lastly, I think Matthew provided us with this problem, right? Yeah. Now, do you like swimming, Matthew? Yeah, he said he loves swimming. Okay. Matthew swims back and forth in this pool six times each day. And in how many days will he have swum a whole kilometer? See, this is a little pool. Actually, it's a normal size, I guess. But 25 meters. And he goes back and forth. Six times each day. He goes back and forth six times. So he goes jun jun once, second time, and so on. When he goes once back and forth, it is 50 meters of swimming. So six times back and forth would be six times 50 meters. That's 300 meters. Okay, one day, 300 meters. How many days will he have to swim? 300 meters per day, so that he will have swum a whole kilometer. Just remember, one kilometer in meters is a thousand meters. This word kilo here, meaning a thousand. So in three days, he will have swum 900 meters, not quite enough. But in four days, he will have swum more than a kilometer. 1,200 meters to be exact. Okay, we're all done.